Hello, I am Russell96, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Castle Progress. Um, I've done a little bit of planning since the last episode, not as much as I li like I liked, or I would have liked to get done, but it should be enough at least for this episode, because I have one part that I basically have completely planned, and we will work on that today. Um, but let's start out up here first, um, I more or less marked out the, like, what's it, courtyard, that's the word, it took me a little bit there, but I more or less marked out the courtyard here, I think I could probably afford to move it this way, like two or three-ish blocks, because basically I just wanted to leave an area open up in the front here for like to have a way to get up here aside from the towers because I could open up like a diagonal doorway here or I could just use the one tower there but as I look at it it might be interesting to try and work the tower into the courtyard design I guess what I what I, well, now that I think about it, what I will probably do will probably just be, like, have the courtyard just warp around it. And actually, I'm not even sure how far back that way the courtyard type thing will go. Kind of depends on what I end up actually doing for stuff in that very wide open area. Um... But I think the height is good. I might move it a little bit up or down at the bottom just so it's not completely level with the, like, war, well, not war zone area, but, like, on the battlement levels, it would make sense to have it, like, go up a little bit so it's not, like, like directly exposed to outside. So if the area was on, if the castle was under siege, like, an arrow flying in, wouldn't be able to get into the courtyard because there would be a staircase going up and unless the arrow was like a magic arrow and like warped and went up the staircase I think people inside the courtyard should be fine except for the entire fact it's wide open to the ceiling but that really does not matter all that much um what we are going to be working on today is this little courtyard to be type thing. Let's not die in our descent. Okay, we're good. But as I was saying last episode, the more I thought about it, the less sense having the staircase like this made. So we're gonna redo it. Um, yeah, so the only entrances to this courtyard to be type thing will be these two doorways. And I might as well just quickly brief my idea ideas to you guys about like what I want to do with this area. Um, it's basically going to be leveled out at this like level because I don't think the doorways would look as nice if they were any lower. Actually I think the doorways could probably be one block taller and look good still. Or look better. Hmm. How tall is this right now? That's four right now. I guess, yeah, let's actually try that because I think that would, that would actually probably look fairly good raised one block. Um, oh god, that insta mine. Yep, yep. Okay, we are actually going to have to ender pearl up there to actually place everything. Um, that there, that there, um, let's just put, well, eh, wait, no, never mind, we don't have to. That's good. Um, but let's only do this to one side in case we don't actually like it. Um, yeah, I just, like, that might actually look better than it did. And... Uh, eh, eh. Yeah, I take it back. I like the... It needs that space there. Um, I will redo that, like, during a cut sometime, so, yeah. Um, but basically my idea was to make, like, a pond type thing. That's what the space in here is for. And in the pond... Well, not... What's... Not pond, um... Not... Eh, I guess it will kind of be a fountain, but in different parts of the fountain 
have like different statues be like the actual fountain or I could depend what I think I might actually do is make like it's going to be a long pool yeah that's a, that's a better word for it but yeah it's basically just going to be a long pool with various decorations and then for the front part I'm thinking I will still leave a doorway on this part because we will have all of this area and that could link back to around here which is right above the like a gatehouse type area and that would be a good way to connect this front wall part to the gatehouse um but I guess what I will do now is fix or undo the change there and like make the outline for everything because I have a lot of stuff to tear down and like replace so I will do that and then we will continue from there. And there is a zombie right there, but that really doesn't matter. Okay, I have just like general markings made and I fixed that archway. Um, and I've actually taken out quite a bit of all of the stone slabs as you might be able to tell because I needed some stone slabs to make all of this other stuff and I didn't feel like wasting stone making more when I already had like an insane amount of them. Um, but let's make this like three-ish wide so that would be roughly there. I don't want the water to go all the way to the edge because I feel like that would kind of be pointless but it doesn't really matter. Um. Now this part, let's take down this so it's less confusing. Now, how would this look? Um, it's not centered, but I think it should be wide enough, like, to work. I think that actually, yeah, that works. Okay. That was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Um. But basically for the actual walkways, I'm just going to use stone and then slabs for a trim. Um, yep. I actually kind of like how this looks like on the edge bits because it kind of adds more detail to it overall. And let's actually just fill in the like floors right now so it's less of a pain to actually like walk here. And I just realized something. Well, I guess I actually already accounted for it. But th right now, this is four, like it'd be a four wide path right there. And I generally like working with odd numbers more. Well, I can't really say that when the entire castle's like centered on even. Um. Uh, let, yeah, let's just go with uh, this for now because I realized that, like, just right now that I also will have to have some type of, like, ledge into the pool. But it looks like I already, in, like, accounted for that. I just, like, did it subconsciously or something like that. Um, I am going to fill in all of the stone because I'm sure you guys don't want to watch that and I don't really have any filler commentary thought of right now so yeah um and the stone is filled in all right the stone is all filled in and actually when i look at it now it it's kind of odd that it goes from four to three so yeah i think i'm gonna move this back one block because yeah that doesn't really work for me I guess and I actually like this look a bit more yeah that actually turns out very well when I do that um anyway I think what I'm going to do for this end anyway is kind of leave it unfinished or like where like nothing is like permanently in place or something like that so yeah, because I'm not really sure what I want this part of, like, the bottom part of the building to look like quite yet. I, ha I have a feeling it's going to be curved, I just don't know how curved, and, like, if I'm just going to curve it around this or curve it outwards, so, 
Yeah, let's just kind of leave that unfinished for now. But one of the things we can do right now is make like a little bridge type thing because I want like each side of the thing to be easily accessible for the other side. And we shall do that by making a bridge. And then that side is connected by the fact that it's actually connected. So yeah, oh, this freaking, uh, um, what's it called? Efficiency 5 and that is not the block I wanted to place. Um, efficiency 5 and haste 2, insta mining and breaking all of the things I don't want to be breaking. Uh. Um, hmm. Actually, I'm looking at this and trying to think of how I want to actually go about doing the actual bridge. Um, I don't think it will have to be all, like, too much of an arch, but I think it should be slightly arched and not just, like, a flat bridge, because, yeah, just, just because, yep, that's basically all the reasoning that needs. Um, that's actually probably enough. Could even just break that and then go like that. And let's go up here. Up. Oh, okay. Um, I feel like this, like, starting part of it needs something else, though. Like, more than just that. Um, how could I go about doing this? But I don't feel like it should go up any higher than that, so we shall work around that somehow. Um... I wonder if this is enough. Yeah, that, that might actually look fairly good. Yeah, I take that back. Okay, um... Maybe I got a different idea. What if we used like stone pillars on the side bits and then like those just kind of come off of it? That might actually look fairly decent just like that, only I feel like it needs to be slightly different, but let's just kind of work with that for now. We can always make minor adjustments to it as we go. There's no, like, actual reason to spend way too much time on one part where it might end up, like, completely changing anyway. Okay, that went up here, two blocks, that there. We need not ender pearls, but a shovel. And by the time we got the shovel on our bar, that could have already been broken, but whatever. Actually, I might want to curve it up one more block. Yeah, because I don't think that's enough curve. Um, and we are building in slabs, like for the actual bridge. So I guess we could like build the bridge off of a slabs arch. And that doesn't really work with in the slabs to begin with. Um, I think it would actually look nice if we started it like this, then built it in layers of two. Yeah, that doesn't look very good at all. Um, hmm, that might actually be too much of a start for it. Let's actually just see what it looks like when the pillars are replaced like this. And then let's connect this. I think we're actually getting somewhere with this, and then let's make it slightly curved. And it would be nice if there were like just regular stone slabs, but unfortunately there's not, so we can't really work around that all that well. And it looks like, yeah, this should work fairly well. I hope. But it doesn't really work all that well if, hmm, 
I think we might just want to make the bridge's arch out of slabs instead of stairs. I think that should probably help quite a bit. Okay, and we do have some slabs, or stone brick slabs. Um, let's make it so it's one below it, so it's like a support to it. Um, yeah, let's go with that. I actually kind of like the look if it like goes down into the water. Okay, and this is the moment of truth. Okay, that will work well, so we can have a stone base to the water without like affecting any other parts of the castle, so let's do that quickly. And I guess it really won't matter what it's actually like below the bridge, because you won't really see that unless you're under the water, so... Yeah, it doesn't really matter all that much. Let's just kind of work with it for now, and I might like put glowstone in the water bits also, so it's like illuminated, because I think that would probably add an overall nice effect to the entire thing. Okay, I'm using a lot of stone for this project, or more of side project, but still. Okay. Yep, what? Oh. <laughs> Derp. Okay, that's like this. Then slab there and then okay and let's just use another another slab doesn't really matter okay and let's just throw down a few torches here so stuff doesn't spawn on us and dirt okay now what do we all have to change up here to make it look decent um feel like that should be a little bit more, but it might also look nice if we like base it off of slabs still. Well then again that won't really work. Yeah, I guess we'll just have to go with that. Oh. Yeah. Um and if we do that, we could prop like this should actually look fairly good. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Let's get those on our bar and fill up the rest of this. Oops. Okay. And then let us put torches on the very end bits. Um, yep, that's right. Well, that one wasn't, but close enough. Oh, and breaking everything again, because, yeah. Okay. How does this look at a different angle? Oh my god, I forgot to light up stuff. Oh, that would have been bad if a creeper spawned and then bombed us. Uh, it looks a little bit bland from the side. I guess what we could do would be replace the very center bits with stone. I think that should help the overall thing a lot. Oh my god, so much dirt everywhere. Okay, now how does that look? I think that should look a lot better. It looks marginally better. I'll almost try expanding it out a little bit. Yep. And efficiency 5. I really should make another efficiency 4 pick for like building because it's better. Um, actually, what would it look like if we gave like the entire thing more of an arch? And I know it's like a different arch, but I think that should actually look good. Yeah, I like that. I'm not sure if anything can spawn on the center of it, but let's hope no. Okay, so that basically does the bridge. Looks good enough. Because we don't want too many um, stone slabs everywhere, because we could just trim it in stone slabs, but I think that might be going a little bit over the top. 
Um, I guess the next thing for me to do would be fill in the bottom of the pool, and that's going to be at this level all stone, so I will do that, and then we will continue from there. Okay, the stone is down, and I did make a slight change to the bridge, or a few slight changes. Um, I changed the edge bits a little bit to, I don't know, look a little bit better, I guess. And for the like actual bridge bit itself I made it more like a yeah I made more of the initial or the second curve in it and I got rid of the bit that went out of it so it looks like this now um I think it's decent I would like it a little bit yeah I guess we could test that right now I'm not sure how much I like having the end bit go out like that. Well, I guess we could, or, hmm, yeah, no, I don't really like that very much at all. What about that? Yeah, I don't think so. So yeah, that is the arch to the bridge now, I guess. Um, it would be nice if it worked a little bit better, but yeah, it doesn't. Um, I might mess around with that a little bit more off camera, but what we're going to work on now is like the actual like walls to the pool part. So let's quickly add in the like first like initial bit of it, which really won't be all that much. It's probably just going to be like a simplish trim to everything, and might as well just do something on that side also. But again, I'm not really sure about what's going to be there. For all I know, it's going to like connect directly to the bridge, which wouldn't really. That actually kind of looked cool. Okay, um, how many blocks is it from bridge to the end of the fountain? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. But let's count full width bits. So, 15-ish. So, let's go... Uh, the center should be about there, I think. Maybe 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, that was good guessing. Um, okay. Wait. Okay, let's make the center there because it's even this way. We can't really have an... Well, we can have an odd center, it's just going to be interesting to build anything centered on an odd center when the other, I guess, dimension is odd, uh, or even. Um, that connects with that. I actually kind of was thinking about this, like, before, before I even started recording. I definitely want to have some type of fountain. I just, not sure how I'm going to work around the entire even an odd thing, but it's going to be there. Um, it's going to be coming out of the pool somehow. Then it's going to be emptying into the pool also. Actually, well, what I was thinking of initially is to give it space on each side of it, extend the, like, actual, like, pool. So it would become something like this. Oh god, breaking everything. Oh. oh my god, why am I at 30 FPS? Oh, now it's back up to 60. I'm going to quickly stop recording and then start again because I think fraps might be messing up. Yeah, okay, hopefully it's fixed now, but like as soon as I stopped recording, it went right back up like, like low 200s. So yeah, not really sure what's going on with that, but whatever. Let's do this to the other side. Oh. Okay. Oh. Let's put 
put that back. Did I break that block? Wow. Um, and then I guess it would also include breaking this also. And then this also if I want to get really specific with it. Which I kind of do. So I guess we're going to do that. And over here also. I did this right, right? I think I did. Sure. Um. Yeah, let's go with that then. Yeah, I think that's right. Or it should be anyway. Oh, okay, okay, now we are ready to continue working on this bit. That puts five blocks there. I kind of want to do some type of something to kind of be like a to kind of give it more like depth and whatnot. So let's do something like this on that side and since it's symmetrical we should probably do the same thing over here or it wouldn't be symmetrical by definition but that doesn't really matter um then i guess we could also put like some type of lighting on that as well um uh how do i want to go about doing that um I might just end up doing uh, like cobblestone fences and then glowstone hanging down from that because I don't think just like a redstone lamp on top of it being lit by a hidden torch would look very good unless we decorated it somehow um yeah let's just leave it like that for now and we can do the same exact thing over here but we need to make more stuff Oh, yep. Wow, that's not where that goes. Actually, we need more stairs also. Uh, okay, let's just do that quickly and get all that stuff made and then grab some more stone. Okay, now let's continue working on this and let's actually put torch and yeah, we'll do that later. Um, but yeah, let's do this and then we will do something for the walls on the inside part. Is it, am I actually making this in the right spot or no? No, it's fine. It really can't go anywhere else. And I think if it's on one side, it should probably be on the other. Yeah, that works. Yep, okay. So that is that. Um, I feel like there should be something for the fountain part, but I guess we can't really fit anything. We could try and do something like this. It It's not really the same effect. It's similar, but just not exact, I guess. Well, it's definitely not exact, and I can't, I'm not sure if you could really say it's similar either, so... Yeah, let's just kind of roll with it for now. We actually, I got a different idea. It's along the same lines, but it's not quite the same. Well, isn't that's the entire point? But whatever. Um. Uh, yeah, that should potentially look decent. I don't think we really need a trim for the top of the stone bricks. I think it looks good, j like just like that. Because if we add anything on top of it, it might be a little bit too tall f without raising the like like walkway itself any so I think we might just leave it like that okay now we need to fill in the walls so we don't have water flowing everywhere else in the castle some areas we can take away more than others like we can't do that because there's stuff there okay um, I feel like the wall should be there, but it doesn't really work there. Um, I guess for, like, the bridge, we can just do something as simple as just stone everywhere. Only not there. <laughs> everywhere except for there, so, yeah. 
Um, but no, we can work around it. Um, but yeah, let's break that, and then that also. Um, I, I think we might be getting to the point of having too much stone, though. So maybe that for a trim. Actually, those stairs are going to look really weird underwater, so let's actually do that right now. Okay. Oh. So that more or less does it for the bridge. And I think that for other parts of it, it might not work how I was originally thinking because we can't indent it that way any. Um, but I guess we will actually end up getting the same feel because we got rid of the, um, or we added the, what am I even trying to say, like the bits that extend over the edge that kind of add this type of like design to the other parts, so I think we should be good. Okay, let's do this quickly, and I would say that's good enough for the bridge. Now for this part. Yep, it, okay, it works fine. Okay, crisis, yeah, crisis adverted. I'm glad when stuff works out like that. It makes me happy. Except for this part. Eh, no, wait, it, it, it should work the same. Okay. Oh, yeah, I need to place that block. Even though it can't really be seen from any angle at all, but whatever. Um, but yeah, let's just go ahead and do this for the rest of it here. Oh, we need more stone bricks, and let's do this part, and let's finish. Um, actually... Uh, that kind of makes that part cluttered, but I think we're going to go with it. Because we can't really do all that much else given the space. Up, oh, and we need to do this part also. Okay, I would say that is probably good for that. Let's place a bit of dirt to get out of here. Let's do a similar thing to what we did down there for this part and just kind of add slabs there to signify something. <laughs> Um, okay, now, what do we want to do for the rest of it? I'm just going to put torches here for now, so yeah, and we're actually over half an hour now, so I might want to start wrapping things up, but I want to get this done, so I am going to make a fountain, um, I'm not very good at making fountains, but I will probably end up going into my test world and make a nice fountain given the dimensions and then I will make that and then I will flood the place and I think we should be done after that oh wait I forgot an entire wall um but yeah I will make the fountain and then I'll be back to continue working after that okay I have the oh my god that was a fail but I have the shape of the fountain made, and I think it should look fairly good. I just realized I won't have any water to fill up anything else. But yep, there's the fountain. It was a little bit annoying making it because the entire even number thing. And we're actually going to have to swim up here to take two bits of water to go down here to make a infinite spring. Which I failed to do. Okay, there we go. Now let's swim back up there to redo or fix the fountain. And I use stairs for the center of it because I thought it looked better than just a solid block. Because I didn't really want to have just floating water. Um, but I think that should look good enough for a fountain. It's very large and I think it does what it's supposed to do, which is look nice. Um, I am going to fill the pool with water, and then we shall quickly make something to be the front part of this. Okay, I would say that the flooded pool slash 
well, yeah, pool. We'll just go with, like, pool. But I would say it looks really nice, and it should be interesting to see how I connect the entire thing to whatever I build there. But that really doesn't matter right now. Let's tear this down, and let's make another ledge. Okay. Now, what do I want to do with this? We want a doorway, which will probably be four blocks wide. So I would say something like that should go there, and I think what we did for the edge bits might actually look really good for what we want to accomplish. So let us try doing something like that. And I really won't be able to do much of anything on the inside part this episode, but we'll get to that eventually. Okay. Let's build down the pillars. And how's that looking so far? Uh, decent. Um, it's not looking fantastic, but it's not looking terrible. Okay, the arch will probably be four up from the ground. That's only three, so let's do one more. I put it in the same exact spot. Actually, given the size, I would say that would probably actually be enough. Let's try putting stone there, and maybe down here. Oh, oh, I did it twice. Okay. Um. Actually, we could probably get away with a two wide doorway because I think that would overall, oh yeah, overall look better. Uh, what does it look like if we bring it down one block? Yeah, I would say that's more fitting for the area. Let's just make that all stone for now. Okay, and I guess what we could do for this side would just be make or finish the pillar. Or, like, add a pillar bit. Break those, and then add stone. Okay. I feel like it needs something else. Um, I think what should help would be adding a, like, some type of ledge type thing to the top. And also, the fact that those bits continue up while the other bits didn't. Actually, that might look kind of cool. Let's just actually put more stone on the other side instead of taking away stone on that side. And maybe if we continue that over also. Okay, I would say that's getting somewhere. Oh. Okay. Now we're to here. I still feel like there's... There needs to be more on the top part, definitely. It's just that it's an even number. It's kind of difficult to actually add anything. Um, well, I'm not really sure what I could add. Let's put torches on top of those, and, um, hmm. I, eh, that probably wouldn't look very good, though. It's just too flat. It needs more depth. I mean, I'm not really sure how to do that given the current, like, design. I guess what we could try is something along the lines of this. Then connect those two parts and have that go up like that to an area in which that would warp back around maybe something like that I, I don't know maybe yeah there's too much stuff there now um okay uh, how are we going to do this oh yeah we break everything all the time uh And I would 
let's say if we started it down anymore, it wouldn't really work either. Um, did I just prove that that didn't really work? And that doesn't look terrible. Okay, how to expand from that. I guess let's try and make some type of fancy railing. That might help. Okay, I think we might be on to something. Yeah, okay, that should look better. And even if it doesn't look fantastic, I might just end the episode here because it's getting late and I kind of want to get this episode out by tomorrow. Um, I would say that looks decent. We could continue. Let's actually just do that quickly also. The same, like, type of thing going this way. Oh. Wow, so much, like, not doing it right. Okay, that's better. Only that joins really oddly. Um, yeah, I think that's good for now. I'll work more on it off camera. Oh, God, I'm glitching out and everything. But I think that's all for today. If you enjoyed it, feel free to leave a like. And I will see you guys next episode. Bye.